have not like and subscribe please go to the google uh, or or the youtube and search for the avian tag champion and you will open this channel if you are new to this channel this channel is uh, regarding the anything related to the apple ios android uh, or microsoft endpoint, endpoint manager okay so in this video uh, today i am going to show you what is the use of the app configurations right and how you can block the personal user accounts from signing into the apps uh, if it's managed devices i mean uh, into an enrolled devices right so uh, you know you can do through uh, do through um, you can you can limit the access and only allow the uh, organization uh, user account and then you can block the personal uh, accounts within so i have have i have article open this one right as you can see so being as an intune admin right you can control right which user account should be added or must be added to any microsoft managed uh, in any applications on managed devices so i'm i'm saying managed devices right so you can limit and you can limit the access to only allowed uh, organization or company user account and block the personal accounts on enrolled devices so if it's managed devices the user will not able to sign in with their personal uh, uh, gmail account or any other um, uh, email account so how you can do that so this this can be uh, done through the app configurations policy and same thing you can do for the ios devices or uh, android devices i will just show you for ios similar way you you can apply for the android devices so uh, how you can do that right so you can uh, you can you just need to go the microsoft in, endpoint portal here you can see the microsoft endpoint portal and go to the app sections and you see the app configurations policy here right so currently i have no any app configuration policies so you can click and you see there is two type of managed devices and managed app so managed app if you are just managing the apps you can uh, you can uh, apply the app configurations policy but i'm talking about because uh, this managed app normally used for the BID scenario or if you want to product uh, uh, the apps on even on managed devices so on managed app uh, app configurations if you want to push something um, on on the app on unmanaged devices you can do but we are talking about this managed devices we can only restrict uh, sign in in from from the managed devices so which is actually fully managed devices or you can say the company owned devices so click on manage devices and here you need to give the name like uh, block personal account sign in okay from manage devices okay you can give any name from manage devices so manage means fully company on devices okay platform you see uh, whatever you want i'm just creating for ios so you can similarly way you can do for android enterprise so and then you have to select the target apps suppose if you want to i'm just uh, i have only outlook so if you have you want to man block sign in for teams or any other applications you can approve the app and the app will show here <coughs> so i'm selecting microsoft outlook select next and then you have to select these either you can enter the xml data if you have or you can use this configuration designer like for outlook these these are the configurations actually is coming so if you want you can configure this or just simply go to the configuration key it's better to configure like if configure email account setting fes and of course you want to use the modern authentication <coughs> username it should be user principal name smtp address so these 
ఎలా వర్క్ ఆర్ స్కూల్ అకౌంట్స్ ఆఫ్ కోర్స్ ఇట్ షుడ్ బీ ఎస్ ఫోకస్ ఈ ఈమెయిల్ సో దీస్ ఆర్ ద యాక్చువల్లీ సేఫ్ కాంటాక్ట్స్ సిగ్నేచర్ ఇఫ్ యూ వాంట్ టు సెట్ సో ఐమ్ నాట్ గో ఇన్ టు మచ్ డీటెయిల్ యూ కెన్ జస్ట్ కాన్ఫిగర్ ఇట్ అండ్ యూ సీ యాజ్ సూన్ యాజ్ యూ యూస్ మేకింగ్ చేంజెస్ హియర్ లైక్ సేఫ్ కాంటాక్ట్ ఇఫ్ యూ సెలెక్ట్ ఓన్ రైట్ యూ సీ హియర్ ఇట్స్ ఆటోమేటికలీ కాన్ఫిగరేషన్ ఈజ్ కమింగ్ అండ్ యూ సీ ద యూజర్ ప్రిన్సిపల్ నేమ్ దేమ్ యూపిఎన్ ఈజ్ దేర్ సో and you see in tune mam allowed account is already enabled you see enable so if you go to this article again just quickly i will show you uh here see only allow organization account in the app so you see in tune mam only account so if it's enabled the only account allowed is the manage user account defined by the mam upnk if it's disabled <coughs> any account will be allowed so you see in tune mam allowed only account and in tune mam upn and both should be it's already there so both is already there so how it's there because we have enable it here so it's by default it came here so and what you have to do just click on next and scope you want you know how to use and then you want to apply to all users all groups or all devices so support i am selecting all users click next that's it so no if any user if any users device is enrolled into uh, into intune and they 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 they, they sign in with your company e- email address they will able to sign in but if they try to sign in with gmail it will block sign in because we have block the we have not allowed the configurations uh, i mean signing in from any other gmail or personal accounts and this is only for the managed devices so if you have on managed devices you can do it from uh, you can do it from as a managed app okay so now you, you know right how you can uh, block personal account sign in from any managed devices on in any many managed app hope you have learned how you can apply the app configurations policy similar like i have created for ios you can do for android enterprise or for uh, and and just apply and, and see till then thank you have a good day bye bye